So this is our version 2.0 turnip beater for the Harley Davidson Custom Kings Street 750 contest. Um, we really kind of wanted to think outside the box on this one. And um, the design on this kind of harkens back to the old land speed bikes and drag bikes of the mid to late 60s. There was one in particular that was campaigned by a guy named Leo Payne. It was a 57 Sportster, one of the originals. And we used that as a template for this one and put all of our own twists on it. Um, a lot of custom fabricated parts on it. As you can see, it's got a, a swing arm that's extended six inches. We fabricated some rear sets for it, custom fabricated intake and, and pipe. Um, we started with some fiberglass pieces, the fairing and the tail section. We modified those to work on the street frame. We went ahead and clearanced and notched the fuel tank for, uh, for handlebar clearance. We're running Harley Dyna wheels, front and back, 19 inch. Machined the rear wheel, or I'm sorry, machined uh, the rear wheel, the front to run on the back. Have a chain drive on it. Um, custom fabricated belly pan. Shaved the front end, shaved the fender mounts on it and stepped it in the lathe. Gave it a really cool racy look. Wrapped the pipe, built the struts for it. Hid some really nice tail lights and turn signals on the bike and that's the shift light because it's a go fast. We're running the Harley Davidson Daymaker um, fog lamps in the front. We tried to do as much Harley P&A on this bike as possible and we still really wanted to make it look custom.